So we have made the purchase day book. Now we'll make the sales day book. The sales day book both in both we record only the credit transactions. Here sales book. The format is same only the difference is in sales book we write the name of the customer and here we write sales and since this is sale we write output instead of input output CGST output SGST and output IGST. Now let us do the question. Record the following transactions in the sales book of Ganesh and company of Jaipur Rajasthan who deals in furniture. Assume CGST 6% and SGST 6%. So we we'll write so he made Ganesh and company of Jaipur maintains a sales book. So we we'll write the name of the customer to whom they have sold. June 4. Okay. So we'll write down the detail. June 4. Sold to Gupta Furniture House. Okay. Gupta Furniture House New Delhi. So we'll write down the details. 120 chairs of 1500 per chair. Okay. So we'll write here 120, 120 chairs at the rate rupees 1500. Uh, sorry, 2500. 2500 per chair. Second detail 25 table at the rate 8000 per table. Okay, 25 tables at the rate rupees 8000 per table okay so in detail we write down 120 into 2500 is coming to 3 lakhs and 25 tables into 8000 is 25 into 8 is 200 so 2 lakh uh, it will be 2 lakhs okay then less 5% rate discount. But first we'll have to add this. So this 2 is coming to 5 lakhs. Okay. So then we have to less discount. Less and the trade discount is 5%. Less 5% trade discount so 5% is 25,000 now we'll minus 5, 000, 5 lakh minus 25,000 this is going to 4 lakh 75,000 okay next we have to add GST now since Ganesh is from Jaipur and Gupta is from New Delhi. So this is interstate. So this will come as IGST. 6% CGST and 6% SGST. 6 plus 6 is 12,000. So we'll write here add, sorry 12%, add 12% IGST. So 12% of 4 lakh 75,000 is 50, 57,000. Now we'll add this and this. It is coming to 5 lakh 32,000. 5 lakh 32,000. Okay. Now we'll write the details. Over here, it will be sale is for after, after getting the trade discount. 
फोर लैख सेवेंटी फाइव थाउजेंड आई जी एस टी फिफ्टी सेवन थाउजेंड एंड टोटल इज फाइव लैख थर्टी टू थाउजेंड ओके नेक्स्ट वी हैव जून एट सोल टू राजा फर्नीचर ओके सो विल राइट हियर नेक्स्ट डिटेल इज जून एट राजा फर्नीचर हाउस अहमदाबाद गुजरात ओके डिटेल्स आर एट एलमिरास At the rate fifteen thousand each. Eight Almiras. At the rate rupees fifteen thousand each. Okay. Next we have. Nine steel cabinets at the rate twenty thousand each. Nine steel cabinets at the rate rupees twenty thousand each. Twenty thousand each. Now we write down the details. Eight into fifteen thousand. Eight into fifteen is one twenty. One lakh twenty thousand. Nine into two is eighteen. One lakh eighty thousand. Now we'll add this to. It's coming to three lakhs. Here we have a trade discount of ten percent. Okay, so we'll write here. Less ten percent trade discount. So ten percent of this is thirty thousand. So after minusing, we have two lakh seventy thousand. Okay. Add this to and less the trade discount. Now this is. Again, interstate, Rajasthan and Gujarat. So we'll have IGST. We'll write here add, and the IGST will again be twelve percent IGST. So twelve percent of two lakh seventy thousand is thirty two thousand four hundred. Now we'll add this to. It is coming to three lakh two thousand four hundred. Three lakh. Two thousand four hundred. Okay. We will write the retail here. After trade discount, the sale is two lakh seventy thousand. IGST is three thirty two thousand four hundred, and the total is. Three lakh two thousand four hundred. Okay. Next we have June twelfth. Sold old computer for rupees fifteen hundred to Mohan and company on credit. Now this will not come because he is the dealer of furniture, not of computer. So for this, what we are going to do is we are going to write down here below. Okay. When we finish this, then we'll write write down the about this why we have not recorded. Then we have June twenty. This also will not be recorded because this is cash. Then we have June twenty five. Okay. So we'll come down. Okay, over this side and write down June twenty five. Detail new furniture, new 
your nature house jaipur okay the details will write down here so the detail is five sofa sets of 2000 each so five sofa sets at the rate rupees 20000 each 10 tables of 8000 each okay 10 tables at the rate rupees 8000 Each. So detail five into twenty is one hundred. So it is one lakh, and ten into this is eighty thousand. Okay. So here the total. We'll write on the total is coming to okay. Come to one lakh eighty thousand. Okay. Now what we'll do is there is no discount, but there is intrastate Jaipur and and he is also from Jaipur. Okay. Ganesh is from Jaipur and new furniture house is also in Jaipur. So we'll write here add six percent CGST and add six percent SGST. So six percent of eight one like eight thousand is ten thousand eight hundred. Ten thousand eight hundred. Now we'll add this three. It is coming to. Two lakh sixteen hundred. Two lakh one thousand six hundred. Now we'll write the detail here. Sale was one lakh eighty thousand. Okay. CGST is ten thousand eight hundred. SGST is ten thousand eight hundred. There is no IGST, and the total is two lakh sixteen. So here, okay. I'll I'm supposed to put here. So finally, what we'll have to do is we have to add this column. So when we add this column, it is coming to nine lakh twenty-five thousand. This is coming to ten thousand eight hundred, ten thousand eight hundred, eighty-nine thousand four hundred, and ten thousand ten lakhs thirty. Six thousand. Okay, so here this is a sales book where we keep the record of the customers. Okay, so we'll I'll just make it this way to make it look better. Okay, so we have the details of the customer details of. Trade discount and GST, and save it to each call. So, students, you can see over here that we are 
completed with the sales book and we have to record only the credit transactions, credit sale of the furniture because Ganesh is the dealer of the furniture and he is from Jaipur. Now for June 12, we do not have any entry because June 12 is the day when he has not sold the furniture, he has not dealt with the furniture but he sold the old computer which is not the per which is not the sale of goods. So for this below we will write down note 1 June 12 will not be recorded in sales book as a as an old computer is sold okay so you can write just short you can write down then we'll write down now if you notice on june 25 even though he is selling sofa set which is furniture but he's selling for cash so this will also not come okay so what we'll write here the next note we'll write down note 2 june 25 will not be will not be recorded as in sales day book we record only credit sales this is this is a cash sales therefore will not be entered okay so here we wrote the details about why we have not entered for june 12 and june 25 because june 12 is sale of old computer which is not a part of business sale and june 25 will not be recorded in sales day book because we record only the credit sales and since this particular is a cash sales he has sold four sofa set to varun for cash and therefore will not be entered so sub journal or subsidiary books are simply the sub journals to reduce the time taking and and too much of problem of that double entry system of journalizing it has been reduced as into different books where the transactions of same kind has been put in those respective books so you go through these two purchase books and sale sales book and keep practicing we have sales return and purchase return also which we will do the other day have a good day